Alrighty, welcome everyone to a new series called Sun Haven. I hope you're all having a good old day. I uh, know I am. Let's go ahead and start up. So I've run, I've been running a campaign with this for a little while. I've really enjoyed it. I was playing around with the demon, um, liked it a lot, uh, and I decided it's finally time to do maybe uh, a new one. So I think that's what we're gonna do. Um, so, running through, I love the idea, we're going to play a random royalty of the last thing, there we go, yeah, so, uh, as far as it goes, it's been a little while, I've been having a good old time, we've got the two f elementals, which is fire and water, if you haven't played this before, I really recommend it, it's like a Stardew with fantasy, um, really fun game, so I'm going to go with that, uh, Let's see, where's the very just, I'm tired looking eye, there we go. Corporate eyes, that, that feels about right. Um, we can do glasses, we can do an eye patch. Eh, there's not much I really want from that. Um, so we're not gonna mess too much around with it. There will be some videos where my face will be in the camera, by the way, it's just not today, because of course it's uh, just taking care of some stuff. Let's go, I, I like the traditional hoodie, I'm good with it. Um. Always traditional boots, or belted pants. Uh, for coloration, let's do... I usually wear like a blackish color almost all the time. That is my general plan. Alright, so we're going to call ourselves Silent. Um, so yeah, if you haven't played this before, basically you can get over here. Um, they've been doing a bunch of updates. It's basically a Stardew meets Fantasy. Um, really fun game in my opinion. Really been having a great time with it. Um... I went through and ran, I think Toolmaster was my starting um, run, I think it was called Miner when I ran it. Um, I'll show my account some other time, but let's go ahead and get started. Again, some days you'll have my face on camera, some days you won't, so for the first episode I don't plan to. Got our first achievement, lo uh, create an elemental character. Now I do have a couple of achievements for this game as already. Um, I'm not aiming for achievements. It'd be nice to perfect the game, but you know, we're uh, we're gonna make, keep it pretty easy. Hopefully it doesn't crash on me. There we go. So this is the intro cutscene, which is different than the one I'm uh, used to. Now I have my own personal one I'm running of this, so. Are you almost done? Uh, Mom, I can't be late for the train. Just a moment, Lynn. If you don't take your time with the metal, uh, or take your time, the metal will warp. You know that. Very true. I know. I just wouldn't want to miss the train is all. That's fair. What's wrong, Lynn? Well, nothing. It's just I don't know if I'm ready to move so far away, uh, far from home yet. Sunhaven is a whole day's ride away. I feel that. Oh, Lynn, we will save up extra coin and visit you. Don't worry. True. But you already put everything into the new home for me at Sunhaven. You didn't even uh, have a cake for your birthday because of me. I feel that. <laughs> Don't worry about things like that. Your future is bright and you should be excited for it. Also, apologies if there is a noise in the background. Not much, unfortunately, I can do with it um, currently, so... Sunhaven is home to uh, Salon, one of the world's uh, greatest blacksmiths. You'll be, f uh, you'll make a fine apprentice to him, uh, and you'll learn a lot. You won't even have time to be worried about the uh, about home. I'd say you're going to meet new people and see new things. Who knows? You might even get married. Married? I'm totally not trying uh, to marry her. My uh, my personal playthrough, <laughs> which I'll uh, show you guys uh, probably in episode two, just to kind of show you what the game will look like. Uh, but actually, you know, well, we may just do a separate series. Who knows? That's right. This isn't just a chance to grow as a blacksmith, Lynn. You do a lot of growing up too. Sunhaven is a legendary town. There's a reason so many people go there to find what they're looking for. True. Pretty shield, by the way. Now come here. It's done. So we are the last of our bloodline, so we the whole goal is to continue our bloodline with this playthrough and become a champion um, for the people. Grandma's old pauldron for me. Um, well, that's an anvil. That's not a pauldron. Okay. I have a, uh, wider shoulders than you, but I think I've made the adjustments properly. Oh, the armor. <laughs> God damn it. Um... Wait, what is a pauldron? I'm gonna look up real quick, one sec. Because I think I've got the idea wrong of what it is. Pauldron. 
Oh, it is a chest piece. Okay, I thought. Oh, it's a it's a shoulder and neck piece. Gotcha. It's a, like a neck guard. Uh, they're reminders of where you came from, what you're working for. Your grandmother passed them down to me when I began blacksmith uh, began my blacksmith apprenticeship, and now it's time they were passed to you. They fit perfectly. Thank you, mother. Oh, I'm really going to miss everyone. Grandma, grandpa, and all the villagers. We're all going to miss you too, Lynn, but we're expecting great things from you. Oh, it's time we need to get going. All right, let's go. So this has nothing to do with us so far. Uh, we're not even on the ship, on the boat. Okay. Oh my, so many people. I hope there's a place for me to sit. Yeah, I'm not even here. Uh, so when I first started playing this, this cutscene wasn't here. So this is also new to me, just kind of as a note. And I started playing this about, I want to say like a month ago. Um, and I will show you some little tricks and tips uh, for those who are new to the game um, that uh, really would have saved me in my first playthrough had I realized them. So. Um, I'm sorry, but, uh, is this seat taken? Sorry, lady, these seats are occupied. Oh, that's fucked up. Oh, sorry to bother you. Who are you talking to? Oh, you were just talking to the camera. Okay. Did you walk away? Uh, hi, hello. I'm sorry to bother you, but is this seat taken? Uh, sorry, lady, these seats are spoken for. Oh, are you sure? I don't, there doesn't seem to be any, I, okay. I don't, I would have just sat down. Uh, it's okay, never mind. Mm. Aww. Dude, that's a fucking cool cat over there. That old man listening to his music and all that. Oh, hey, yo, look at me. I guess I could try one more time. I am, uh, excuse me, but is this seat taken? Not all, there's room for one more. So, uh, for note, for those who watch this, if you want to type down in the comments who you think we should try and focus on romancing through this playthrough, um, I will uh, definitely try and stick to whatever the, the few comments we get um, state. Oh, I mean, that's good. I was worried I wouldn't find a spot. Yeah, lady, feel free to join me. Um, it's fucking King Frog. I just caught one of those recently. Lynn. Oh, um, so is this, uh, is that a charm on your belt? People from my village wear charms all the time. What does your charm mean? Uh, it's a charm to bring romance. Romance keepsake. All right, cool. Last time we just got our time keepsake. Romance, like getting married? Well, it's pretty. It's a pretty charm. Hey, if you don't mind me asking, are you heading to Sunhaven? Uh, how did you know? So, are you are heading there too? Yes. <laughs> I did just say that. Uh, well, that's uh, if that's where you're headed, then that will make us neighbors. You're going to Sunhaven too? I'd be neighbors with you any day. <laughs> Damn. Uh, that's right. I actually just left my village for the first time. I'm a little nervous, but I think I'll be okay. Uh, by the way, my name is Lynn. What's yours? Silent? Yes, I don't talk much. Uh, that's a very unique name. It truly is. My parents named it because I didn't cry when I was uh, when they pulled me out of the sun. Oh my, you're from the great city. How exciting. I come, uh, come from a village in the eastern region. It's a lot smaller than Sunhaven. I wonder if you're, uh, you've heard the rumors. It's said that monster folk have been spotted in the recent times around Sunhaven. And that deep in the forest there's a city of darkness where all the sorts of monster folk live. I have no idea. No, nope. City of Darkness, what? Well, that's a rumor, but I'm sure it's only rumors. Uh, Sunhaven must be a safe place, don't you think? Um, <laughs> we're here to find out. After all, they have their own guardian dragon protecting it, and he must be pretty powerful. Yeah, except you keep getting fucking annoying bosses showing up at your door. Uh, whoa, it sure got dark suddenly, didn't it? We're probably going through a tunnel. Uh, did you bring a light? I, can s I can't see a thing. What happened to the light? Just stay calm, it will be okay. What was that? I'm not sure, but I think uh, we're safe. I think the lights went out, I guess. You don't think it was the monsters, do you? It's probably nothing. No. I doubt they uh, decided to traumatize our, or to attack our train with uh, magical darkness. Um, we can't be far, uh, too far from St. Heaven now, can we? We should be arriving soon. Let's hope. This is a gorgeous game, by the way. A little, little white cat. I love this opening cutscene. This is a lot better. The original cutscene was just you going into your farm and basically getting uh, a bunch of tools from um, uh, the plant or the general and um, seed shop owner, uh, who I forget the name of. Now arriving at Sunhaven, we seem to have encountered some strange dark fog, so be careful as you step off the train. Then, yeah, we, I already know what that's for. So, for the reference, this is due to um, this is the path to the uh, uh, one of the other areas. Uh, that we can't get through until we do our quest line. Yeah, this whole thing's very different. I wish I had uh, gotten a recording of the original, but I think you can find enough recordings of the uh, previous update. 
I uh, will say on this, um, there's a bug that I had an issue with. Thankfully, they patched it for the most part, um, which was the King Slimus fight. Um, God, that was an annoying thing to deal with. So let's hopefully uh, play through this thing and have a good time with it is my goal. My goodness, what happened? Our uh, I think lights went out. Oh, and your train station is messed up. We saw the cloud darkness sweeping across the land. It finally stopped here at the train station. Trains won't be able to come and go from Sunhaven like this, but then, uh, but that can wait. Are either of you hurt? No. Uh, it was quite frightening, but no one was hurt. What is that darkness, Nathaniel? Oh, he looks kind of cool. I like his eyes. Uh, the armor could use a little bit of work, though. That's a good question, Lucia. What should we do about the transition? Nothing. The darkness, whatever it is, looks like it isn't going anywhere or causing any harm. Let's keep an eye on it for the moment until we can learn more about it. Alright, cool. Oh, my apologies. You both uh, seem to have arrived under an unusual circumstance. I'm Lucia, Archmage and leader of Sunhaven. This is Nathaniel, captain of our city guard. Welcome. Uh, you must be our new apprentice blacksmith, Lynn, and that would make you silent, our new farmer. Well, as leader of Sunhaven, I like to meet our new citizens personally. Uh, you look like a red mage from D&D, uh, &D, and that's concerning. Also, what are your hip? Jesus, lady, you've been working out something fierce. Your core is going to be fucking terrifying. Um, it's good to meet you both. Uh, take my word that you have nothing to fear in Sunhaven. <laughs> um, I feel protected, buddy. Um, it is our sworn duty to keep the people of Sunhaven safe no matter what. Don't worry, I'll face this darkness. I don't think you. Frederick, my sword. You have a sword. Um, Nathaniel. So he just carries a sword on him for looks and then has another person. Okay. Thank you, Frederick. I don't think a sword will work. Need some time to research it and come up with a solution. I'm not really. Hmm, you may be right. A sword probably isn't the best thing to fight the dark magic clouds with. It, uh, I'll post some guards to keep uh, watch of the area. In the meantime, well, you got barracks over here by the looks of it, so it should be fine. All right, Frederick. False alarm. You are dismissed. <laughs> Dude's dragging the sword. He's a great kid. After his apprenticeship ends, oh, he'll make a fine guard all in good time. Speaking of a good time, maybe it's a good time to show our new citizens their homes. Yep. I think you're right, Captain. After what they've been through, I think rest is in order. Come with me, Silent. Your farm is waiting, and I'll show you your new home. Lynn is right near the quarry. I can't wait to see the work you do and uh, you and Silent do. Oh, and it's nice to meet you too, Silent. Mm, okay. Uh, thanks for chatting with me on the train, Silent. Maybe we'll be able to talk again uh, soon. Goodbye for now. Yeah, hopefully. Oh, and could I ask you to not mention the darkness to your fellow villagers? I just don't want everyone to worry is all we've got under control. Okay. Shall we see our new farm, uh, your new farm together? Eh, why not? She's an archmage. Damn. Should have expected. Welcome to your farm. Um, despite how adventure, uh, adventurous your arrival here it was, I'm sure we'll have it all figured out soon. <laughs> uh, so by the time this video goes up, depending on if I'm putting this up after Stardew finishes or if I'm putting this up um, like this this week, uh, I should I may or may not have moved already. You know, for those who don't know, I'm moving to across the uh, the country to Florida. Um, I live currently in Oregon, so I'm looking to like move across to the entire country later this year. Uh, so depending on if this comes out in like October or if this comes out this month of May, because today's May 1st, uh, we'll see. Well, here we are, Silent. First thing is first, though. You need to decide where your house is going to go. Uh, go ahead and pick a spot, So, you, uh, just so you know, the path we're standing on leads directly into the Sunhaven. You can place your house uh, close to the bridge if you'd like to be close to town. I can see some pretty nice spots from here, but it's all up to you to decide. Good luck and farewell. All right. Okay, so we do have... With this regal crown. Okay, be the king or queen of all... Uh, okay. I have a crown now. All right, so we can jump. We have uh, some spells, elemental tap, tap in the mana of the earth, restoring uh, mana plus 10% of your mana, X mana to yourself. Oh, cool, that's nice. Um, and then we have a house, okay. So I'm gonna put my house in the same place I had it last time. Um, I have a specific area I like to work because of the fact of how um, everything kind of shows up in, around here. Can't move it over too much to the right, but we can do like right there. Yes. Cool. Alright, so 
got a nice little house. Oh, okay. Oh, yep, here comes the little, there's a gypsy lady. <laughs> Hi, Anne. Um, you're looking as bodacious of ever, her fucking red orange eyes. Knock, knock, look at you up and at him already. <coughs> you're really committing to this farm gig, huh? That's great. Uh, who are you and why are you in my house? Ah, where, uh, where have my manners gone? I, exa I agree. Uh, my name is Anne, and I happen to be Sunhaven's most distinguished merchant. I want to be officially welcome. Uh, I want to I wanted to officially welcome you to your new uh, to your new farm, the new farmer to town. Man, I can't read. <sighs> All right. Speaking of which, I can't help but notice you don't seem to have any farm tools or seeds. Why don't you uh, let me take care of that? Seriously, what are you doing in my house? I want to make a deal with you. I call Anne's ready to go farm kit. All the tools you'll need plus 15 wheat seed. All. Oh, uh, 150 yeah yep no tough customer huh i like that and a business partner there's no relationship stronger than one born in business you know why don't we step outside and you can show me how uh you do your work uh let's get the seeds in ground all right cool here we go now i will organize my tools because i don't like how they um have them set up uh as far as it goes um so that's usually how I run it. Very similar again to Stardew. Let's get our first farming plot set up. So nice thing in this, you might notice, there's no energy bar. I don't know if they have plans to change it. Um, I don't think they will be. Oh, I forgot, I've got slow mining speed. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be interesting. So for those run there, um, on my main, or on my first run that didn't have the intro, um, I am level like 200. I'll show it at the end here of the first recording. Let's get rid of all the tool tickets. Yeah, there we go. I want to be able to see. Oh man, I forgot how long this would take. Uh, I'm so used to having so many more tools in this, or so much better tools in this. But that's okay. Fresh start is always a good idea. All right, let's clear out the last of this. Yeah, so, um, without spoiling too much, I'm pretty far in the other one. Um, like I said, I'm not going to show off everything, but I will at the end of this video show you guys where I'm at, so you can have a reference. Um, to note, um, nice. I have tilled the ground. Uh, let's get our exploration rank up. Unlock air skip spell. Uh, oh, wait, do we have no points? What? Oh, okay. Oh, it was a tool tip. God damn it. Uh, with something else. So that is what? Five, one, two, three, four, five. Yep. One, two. There we go. So this should be enough. Now, again, you think now this looks slow, and this is. This is pretty normal. Um, one of the first things I recommend is always switching your days to 40, by the way, when you get first in. And you'll understand why this is very important. I didn't know this in the very beginning, and this did lead to some issues. Um, but to show you kind of the menu interface, we have our armor equipment. Pretty easy, our romance bonus, which will be really nice later on. These are all of our skills um, that we'll show off later. Um, we've got, these are all the locals. Um, I don't know, okay. Oh, they updated this to let you know if you've given them a gift for the day, that's really helpful. Um, this is where your quest log is, pretty easy. And then you've got a map of a thing without showing too much. Uh, as you can kind of see, there are gonna be multiple maps. Um, and then you've got your other stuff, like all your stats, and then simply here. Now you can play this on multiplayer with friends. I haven't tried it yet. I do want to, but at the same time, I'm uh, kind of uh, still skeptical for it right now. But now we're gonna sit here and get all this watered up. So tap into the men of the earth, restoring mana plus 10%. Uh, okay, so nothing really useful for me overall, but um, we can mess around with that as time goes on. And you can kind of see again, this takes slow. Oh, this is a very slow process to do this, but it's all part of uh, the whole thing. Now, we didn't get a fishing rod. Um, I think we have to go get that at the beach. I'll show you guys that as well. Boom. All right. Uh, and then we need 10 logs, so I'm just gonna cut down this tree. We got some better placement for the higher tier woods. Uh, that's hardwood over there. That's uh, the fucking big stone. Again, almost identical in many aspects to the idea of Stardew where you have that progression build um, until you're like min-maxed. 
Um, now, and the only reason I'm going to show you guys my other one here uh, later is because of the fact that um, it'll show you the differences. Um, there is a, a bit of a difference in how this uh, or the updates have kind of changed things from when I started playing, uh, and I do plan to continue to maintain to my. Um, oh, do I not? Oh, I didn't get air skip yet because I haven't leveled it up enough. Okay. Um. There's okay, so we're already gonna get exploration. Let's get the mining. Uh, let's get the farming XP. We'll level up both. Nice job, farmer. Not bad for such a small uh, job. If you really want to build up your farm, you should take those logs to craft a crafting bench. Uh, hey, I can see one from here. Yep. No, I know. Mm-hmm. Uh, after uh, at a crafting bench, you can uh, turn logs into planks and other useful things. Anyway, I have other business to tend to. You should check out the town general store. You can buy more seeds because, let's be real, a measly 15 wheat is not going to be that far. Uh, it's strictly to the right of your farm. You, can re uh, you can't really miss it, especially if you check your map and press M. Anyways, it was nice to meet you. Uh, mm, what was your name? I'm silent. Thanks for finally asking. Oh, oh yeah, cute name. Listen, Silent, if you want to make real money, try growing more like uh, 40 wheat once you harvest it. Uh, sell it all into the cell partner portal uh, next to us. Nice. So, yeah, we'll, we can get one of these for each of the different seasons. Um, I don't think it really matters much, but it makes some nice profit for a change. But it's up to you, Silent. Live uh, your life uh, here in Southern Haven however you want. Just make sure it pays. All right. Appreciated. All right, let's uh, level up some stuff. Um, let's see. So I usually like to go with uh, some free stuff here. The next, uh, if every cook meal sells for twenty percent extra. No, let's let's start getting uh, some free um, farming supplies coming in, uh, and then I want air skip. That's why. <laughs> um, all right. So for the meantime, um, first things first, we're gonna go ahead and start getting that all cut up. We're gonna leave that be for right now. I'm not gonna mess around with this too much. Um, because we already have everything going on. Use the general map. Yeah, or the store. Yeah, let me just grab the general map here. Roma install. Oh, that's good to know. Um, so general, basically to keep in mind, is there. Oh, yep, we ate all of our mana. Oh, no. Nice thing is we got that queue, so we can just sit here and use that when we want. We can also sit here and go and eat um, food, which is going to give us some bonuses and such. These are just some tokens for the spring, and of course that's just a tree sapling. We got some stone with us as well. We're gonna immediately start grabbing food to scarf down. This will give us extra points and other such things. So there's the general store. I'd better head inside and see what they got. Yep. So this is where you can get all your crops pretty easily. Uh, you can go in here and repair these stalls and such um, as time goes on to get more items. You got to be the new neighbor people are all talking about. Welcome to the general store. Oh, wait one second. Hey, Emmett. He basically runs all the shops around here. He's the uh, cashier for everything. There we go. Anyway, I'm Emmett. I work here and I'm oh, and over at the farming shop and down at the fishing store and in the town hall. Okay, I work a lot. I heard people say you're supposed to be a farmer. Well, uh, we sell lots of basic seeds among loads of other things. Our furniture stock also changes every day. Be sure to stop in and see what's new. Wait, so how do you know? I didn't even read what I said. Oops. <laughs> Um, keep my, uh, I keep my nose to work, uh, no distractions, but all, uh, and I move really quickly. Do you ever not work? Ah, that's the great thing about this place, that there's never not any work to do. See, they set up that bulletin board right outside the shop. Everyone's always there uh, po to post up job offerings. Well, those odd jobs net me pretty good uh, gold coin or two, uh, that's for sure. If you don't waste your time with that stuff like sleeping, you have all sorts of time to get work done. I'll check out the bulletin board out myself. Eh, eager to help out. That's funny because I was actually meaning to finish delivery that was posted on the board. Thing is, though, I don't think I'll be able to finish it in time due to the, uh, being stuck at work all uh, and all. Why don't you complete the delivery for me? Sure. Hey, oh, neat. Thanks for a lot. Uh, here's an order to Salon, our smith. I was supposed to deliver him. Uh, all right. Just take the order to him so he can smith up what our barracks need. And remember that people can't wait forever. Usually only get a few days to complete a task once you accept it from the bulletin board. Oh, and feel free to take a look at the shop. I'm here all day. Uh, I'm also in several other places all day. Just take your time. So we're not going to mess around too much. Um, ooh, actually, I do want to buy 
one of each of these because we're going to need them at a certain point for other things. Yeah. So I always buy basically all of it. Now you can't grow grapes in the very beginning. Uh, that's my advice to you to keep in mind. Um, so just kind of going with that. We're going to toss all that up there. Now my favorite place to go is definitely the mines over here. I'm not going to bother talking to Lynn because I got nothing for her to um, give her. So, not any value there. There is this gentleman who, I don't know what his whole deal is. Hmm, I used to be Salon's apprentice, but he said my copper helmets always come out dented. I ain't even gonna, okay. That's unfortunate. Now, we did spend a bunch of gold, which is fine. I'm not too concerned. Well, now, I bet you're the flirtatious new farmer Lynn was going on about it. Salon Sunhaven's blacksmith. Lynn's uh, my apprentice, so you best watch your step around her, you hear? Yeah, why not? Ah, uh, it's that pesky little dragon again. Uh, blimey, look out. Hey! Okay. Yep, here he is. Listen, man, I'm just here to go into the mines. Damn it, that little lizard caused a ruckle outside. Ugh, I think one of my toes is smushed. Oh, wait, that's fine. Uh, alright, then let's get these rocks cleared out. Help me out, will you? Sure. This is our mining tutorial for those wondering. Bum. You do get faster with mining again. I'll, I'll uh, show it here in a minute once we get done with the cutscene to kind of go over everything. There you go. Alright then, uh, that'll do it. Thanks for the help, of course. Maybe I was a little quick to judge you, farmer. What was the baby dragon doing anyways? Um, it's been roasting up in the warm, uh, quarry rocks. I figure it must like the heat. Uh, I'd let him stay, but the old da bugger doesn't seem to know its own strength. A single flap of its wing, uh, can send a robot flying. What should we do? Uh, for my part, these two copper helmets from the barracks order won't hammer themselves for you. I reckon that'll be a talk to the archmage. archmage. Uh, well, I got part to play. I mine ain't lugging, uh, these old bones back to town while the forge is hot. Right. Um... More farm. Uh, let's get some mining XP. Just kind of get that up now. Um, extra stones are going to definitely come in handy. I'm not as uh, gain a bonus of 40. That will come in handy, but stone notes have... Yeah, we want this. Um, and there'll be a reason why. Again, since we are set up here, I'm going to exit game. You can exit any point you want. Um, that's the nice thing. So I'll exit that. And then I'm going to show you really quickly... Now I have three characters because I was going for the achievement for that one. So here's my other silent. And as you can kind of see, I'm a lot better off here. And without doing too much of a spoiler here, you can see like I've got the a pretty big house here. And I just want to show this off to show what I've done. Um, and there's a reason I'm not going to continue this save with the recording is because of the fact that you guys will not know what's going on. And plus I'll miss out on a lot of the free content. So this is basically what I'm set up as. Um, so to kind of give you guys an idea, you can kind of see my farming, my exploration, mining is really high, combat isn't as much, and then fishing I'm still working on. Generally, I'm sit, sitting pretty pretty, or pretty well off, um, and you can kind of see how I've uh, kind of built myself up. So this is something to kind of keep in mind. This is basically what the game will look like as you go. Now there is some stuff to note that my, this save file, the reason I'm not using it is because there's a bunch of different stuff that I wouldn't be able to do um, on the recording, so that's something to kind of keep in mind. But there's my episode for today. If you guys enjoyed um, this playthrough, I you know hope you will come back and watch again. Um, I'm like way over here in the corner. There we go. There. Uh, I hope you guys will come back again and watch more. And if you guys want to see more content, uh, feel free to give it a like. If you guys don't like the material, no issues. Um, we will just, I'll just keep playing this on my own and we'll find other games to play. So I'm going to continue to upload regularly again now that I'm done smoking. Um, I've quit smoking weed for a while, so, uh, but actually permanently, um, I'm not quit. Like I'm not just actively buying this stuff anymore. Um, so as far as it goes, uh, going forward, uh, we'll have some more content going up on the YouTube channel, probably a ton, uh, more daily uploads and yeah, so we'll, uh, get that going. Um, if you guys enjoy it, let me know and then uh, we'll see you guys there.